Tracy started to suspect that she was having mood swings shortly after her 45th birthday. It started innocently enough. Tracy would start tearing up at bathroom tissue commercials or cute cat videos. She started feeling more sensitive to news stories and becoming outraged at injustice. But then it started happening more often. Things that didn't used to bother her started to irritate her. She knew that she was overreacting to things, but why? It wasn't until her best friend, Kathy, forwarded her a video about perimenopause that Tracy realized what was going on. She wasn't going crazy. She was entering perimenopause. Perimenopause is the period of time before a woman's menstrual cycle stops. It's called menopause when a woman goes 12 months without a period. And before that, it's called perimenopause. It can take a very long time, up to 10 years. It's a time when a woman's periods change in regularity and flow. They can be closer together or farther apart. They can be lighter or heavier. A woman can miss one or two and then start back up again. But if a woman is on the birth control pill, she may not experience the changes to her menstrual cycle. In fact, mood swings can often be the first sign of perimenopause. That's what makes so many women and their loved ones feel like they're losing their minds. There's actually a biological reason for these emotional highs and lows. Hormones such as estrogen influence the production of serotonin, which is a mood-regulating neurotransmitter. Since a woman's levels of estrogen drops during perimenopause, serotonin levels drop too. Mood swings aren't something you just have to live with, however. There are treatments available, which include hormone therapy or lifestyle changes. Check with your endocrinologist to see what's best for you. If you're experiencing mood swings and don't know why, or if someone sent you this video as a hint, visit hormone.org to learn more about perimenopausal mood swings.